Hello everyone, welcome. This is Feline Intuition 1111. This is going to be a collective reading. Let's see what messages want to come out for you. What are the messages for the collective? What are the messages? We have keep your options open. Spiritual cleanse. Treat yourself, don't cheat yourself. Okay, what's going on here? We got fake it till you make it, pretending to be more than they are, keeping up with Joneses, not allowing people beneath the surface. Some of you may have someone who, I don't know if this was like a connection that didn't last long or someone that you considered dealing with but didn't decide to deal with, but there's something about someone, or maybe this could be in the near future, where someone's stuck on you. They pretended to be more than they are and they're now stuck on you because maybe you pulled away or you're keeping your options open. What are the messages for the collective? Let's see what else is going on. <laughs> see, I was going to say that obsession. Holding on, clinging, can't let go, anxiety. So whether this was a connection that wasn't, you know, serious or if it's a serious ex, someone is obsessed because you're choosing to move forward. Butterflies, feeling complete, can't stop smiling, happiness, devotion. Pursuit, chasing, persistence, hunting down, resilient. And we got memories, reminiscing, dwelling, good times, looking back. So somebody is, someone's stuck on you, it's giving that energy. But let's see. What are the messages for the collective? I feel like you saw the truth about someone. Eight of Wands, they're really gonna be reaching out to you a lot. What are the messages for the collective? Four of Pentacles. Someone is holding on, okay. Could be a Virgo for some of you. Knight of Cups. It's like somebody wanted to have you without having to like, you know, step up and stuff like that. And you decided to walk away or you've become distant. And it's now that they want to stop playing these games, come forward. This person kind of seems like a time waster. I don't know if they're going to actually make sense when they come back around or if they're just trying to get the door back open. But it seems like you walked away from a time waster. Some of you, they're not as stable as they maybe pretended to be financially or they, they don't have a lot going for them or they don't have confidence, something like that that they're lacking that they pretended to have. But I see them coming forward. I see them refusing to see that you are either not interested or not willing to put up with what they are offering. And they stay wishing for you. Some of you could be this king of wands, whether you're male or female. You just go for what you want. You leave when things are not going right, when things are not looking, when things are looking shady. Why the four of pentacles? They're holding on to you. Is this the one that you either left out in the cold or you're going to leave them out in the cold? It could be a Scorpio, Virgo, Taurus. But they're not going to let go. I feel like they really put on a front to try and get you. And then when the truth came out or when the truth does come out, you're going to be kind of, or you are kind of distant. Why the King of Pentacles in reverse? Page of Cups, the world in reverse. They could be emotionally mature. They could, there's something that they just don't have that you're just not gonna, you're just not gonna deal with it. So either they're like, I don't know, still keeping their options open or they're just not as financially stable or they're not as mature. They're definitely emotionally immature. Why the three of pentacles in reverse? Yeah, 
Yeah. You, some of you just gave up on this person. Three of Pentacles in reverse. The Magician in reverse. You feel like they're manipulative. You feel like, okay, this person is like, It's like they know they want you, but they also like, there's something they won't let go of, like some silly behavior or something that you don't want to put up with that this person, it's like they don't see what's holding them back. Why the, the hermit in reverse? Some of you could have blocked this person or you're just not speaking to them. They're going to find some way to speak to you. You got the High Priestess too, Nine of Pentacles. I feel like you tend to just live your life, keeping your spiritual health, you know, healthy, cleansing yourself spiritually, staying away from whatever makes you unhappy. So you could have walked away from this person because you saw some red flags or something like that, but this person isn't, they're not giving up on it. I'm not giving up on the situation. Why the Knight of Cups? They're gonna stay trying to rebuild this. They still have feelings for you, even if they haven't expressed their feelings. They feel like, for some of you, they feel like you have feelings for them too and that you're running from this. Almost like they're kind of delusional. Even if you do have feelings for, for them, I feel like you are just not willing to put up with something that they have going on. Why the Seven of Swords in reverse? And the fool. They feel like they don't want their efforts to go to waste, even if there was no effort. Some of you, this person would think that what they did was a lot of effort, that they invested a lot into this. Could be a Leo for some of you. Why the Two of Swords? They refuse to see, wow, Queen of Swords, Queen of Wands. Some of this person could have been a player or they wanted you to put up with that type of behavior or something similar to that. And you said no, and this person refuses to see that you're not gonna, that you don't play that, you're not gonna deal with it. That you'll walk away from a bad situation. I'm hearing no Fs given. Why the Nine of Cups? Their wish is to, <laughs> this, who are you dealing with? Like this is, this person annoys me if this is really what it's saying because they, their wish is to reconcile with you while still be, still being, I hate Joe E, okay, male or female. They still want to, love is in reverse. They still want to entertain other options or still kind of be you know loose in some type of way and still have you and have you come back to them but some of you are getting over them could be a gemini for some of you some of you are getting over this person they their wish is their wish for some of you they yeah, some of you have someone who straight up wishes that they could have you and someone else and they don't see anything wrong with that with the two of swords I don't like this person. They, they're just the type of person that I just find weird. Let's look at the main spread. Hope something different comes out because. All right. What are the messages for the collective? What are the messages for the collective? Seven of Swords in reverse again. 
Death in reverse. They feel like you freed yourself from this. They feel like you're pursuing other people now or you're going towards someone new. For some of you, they feel like that's low-key the reason why you walked away, but it doesn't have to be that, that that's the reason. Tower in reverse. Okay, that was just some noise. I think there was construction going on in the neighborhood somewhere, but yeah, this person, I feel like they're very... They're very, it's almost like they have two sides because they're slightly manipulative. King of Cups in reverse, Magician in reverse. They could be younger than you for some of you. Why are they seeing you as a Knight of Cups? Page of Swords. They're watching you possibly at this moment online. Page of Swords. They think you're talking to someone else. Now, if you have blocked them or you are not speaking to them, they think you're speaking to someone else. They feel like, in their mind, they feel like you have distanced yourself from them because someone else has your attention. There's something kind of, something about this person where they're not really getting the point that there's just something about them that you're not going to put up with. They're kind of looking for every other reason in their mind, even if some of you have given them the exact reason. They're like trying to tell themselves, no, it's not that, it's this instead. <laughs> Why the Seven of Swords in reverse? They are very much attracted to you, but I feel like they like it when you reject them. This person is strange. strange they like it when you reject them they like the challenge because yeah you got chasing persistence resilient hunting down pursuit this person they like to chase you they like when you reject them they like that challenge of like <laughs> working for your attention they like there's something that they like Something kind of chaotic that they like. To where it might get annoying where they may keep doing things. To get you to, you know, be annoyed with them and distance yourself. Why the devil in reverse? Knight of Wands in reverse. This person feels like they feel like you you can leave them so easily i don't know why but something about that really makes them excited for you there goes the noise again let's just work through it why the king of cups in reverse six of swords okay What is wrong with this person? Some of you, okay. This person likes drama. They like when it's like push and pull and they have to fight for you and they have to do what they have to do. Why the, th why the three of cups? Nine of pentacles, five of pentacles. Their fear is that that you could easily move on. Like this person is so, I don't know if they like risky behavior, but it's like they don't want you to talk to someone else. That's their fear. But they also want to play with you to the point where you don't want to be around them anymore. To where you would look for someone else, but they don't want you to find anyone else. They want to be able to this reading is like why the five of swords it's 
Six of Wands in reverse. Eight of Pentacles. They like the game. And they like to work for you. This must be some kind this must be something that happened in their childhood where they had to work for love or something, because this is too much. Why the ace of pentacles? King of Cups, King of Swords in reverse. I feel like this person has two sides. They may have like a very loving side that you were drawn to, but then there's this other side where it's like something must have happened to them. Like they had to really work for their parents' attention or something because they have this, they like to chase, but they also want you, but they want you to run. They want you to be running why the why the magician in reverse and at this point i'm just i'm just going through with this reading at this point because this is okay justice in reverse nine of swords in reverse this person They have some type of imbalance going on. And they may avoid people who are too easy to get. You may be their most challenging person. They could be a Scorpio, could be a Libra. Nine of Swords in reverse though. Okay, why the why the ace of wands in reverse? The sun could be a Leo for some of you. They're not going to give up because the nine of the nine of wands is about persistent, regardless. Even if they're blocked, especially with the sun, this person with the ace of wands in reverse. Don't matter how much you reject this person, they're still coming for you. Like they have this obsession going on they love to be pushed away and like obsess over a person and chase that person and what is got why the two of swords in reverse again with a page of cups in reverse something happened in this person's childhood emotionally where they, the, like the way, the way they deal with the, there's an imbalance again with the temperance in reverse, justice in reverse. There's an emotional imbalance. You're going to come to realize this. Some of you may, I don't know if they're going to confess this or if you're going to start to see more clearly that this person actually enjoys this back and forth. Let's see what the Oracle cards have to say because what's going on here with the collective what are the messages resistance secret admirer suppressing timid they like when there's like a challenge hopeless sinking despair falling apart Releasing, letting go, moving on, walking away. I feel like you are like done with this or yeah, for the most part you are because it's saying keep your options open and treat yourself, don't cheat yourself. You got influences, attachments, third parties, peers. Okay, there's noise again, but... What are the messages for the collective? boss b energy you see you are that challenge look at this inner child can i come out and play there's something going on with this person like in their childhood they they had to work for love they had to 
chase their parents for attention like they like this they enjoy this they enjoy the back and forth and because you're actually walking away from them that excites them so it's like yeah temptation it's like there's something about your looks as well empress and this card Comic, the soul, soul tie, the comic. Interference, again, third party. Friends, work, family. Clarity will come, clarity will soon come, which is in your outcome to a swords in reverse. You're gonna see something really clearly. Like you may be confused about this person right now because they are a confusing person, but you, something's gonna happen where you see exactly what's going on with this person, why they, keep doing what they're doing it's all gonna make sense soon hold on what is the third party influence king of wands in reverse queen of wands upright could be a father figure for them that hurt them or wasn't around Three of Swords and the King of Wands in reverse and the Queen of Swords upright. They could have some kind of parental situation that caused them a lot of emotional pain as a child and they keep like reliving that. What are the messages for the collective? Let's let's heal each other karmic debts ptsd healing you see what i'm saying wow you are triggering my wounds dysfunctional family childhood trauma abandonment what was i saying This person, they're reliving their childhood with you. And it's right under the inner child card. This person. I feel bad for manipulating you. Narcissistic tendencies, playing the victim, childhood issues. They know that they manipulated you. Like I said, I feel like they have two sides. Where a part of them is very loving. But a part of them has that trauma where it's just like. They can't help but play this game because it feel it's so familiar to them. Then you got I want to gift you something special, unexpected, surprise, sentimental. So they could be wanting to give you a gift as a way of getting back with you again but you know children childlike innocent fun again with a childhood but again they just want to repeat repeat that cycle mature woman socialite connect to high society so again some of you could be older than them and it's like they see you as a parental figure or you're just more mature than them you just remind them of a parent career business success achievement and true love pure love honest connection some of you could be because yeah right underneath it is new love some of you could be about to find a new person a new love you have fun what are the messages for the collective Love yourself first, perfect. Arguments, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I just like spat, but like <laughs> the fact that this came out like there's like arguments, yes. Because they love it, I told you. They love the conflict, the drama, the arguments. They love this. Okay, be careful. 
Safety first, be careful. Love triangle. They might even do things to make you jealous to purposely create this um, drama. Obsession, poison. Yeah, there's something toxic about them. They, I feel like they have two sides. The loving side may have attracted, to, attracted you to them and then you get closer and you're like, okay, it's just nothing but drama or there's always these weird, like what looks like the party showing up, but really they just kind of want to make you jealous and angry so that you you know argue with them and there's this drama and there's this separation and they have to chase you true love again some of you are about to find someone short-term connection yeah some of you this was short term you may have seen the red flags and ran power couple stability joy and stability you might find someone more stable than this person because it would take for this person to heal this wound for them to actually be with you fully because they're going to do something again to make you leave them and so that they can chase you because that's what they like. So either they're going to heal that or you're going to find someone else but there's a true love for you coming in. You got obsession here twice. You remind this person of their parent, the one that they had to chase. The parent they had to chase. That is who you remind this person of okay why the love triangle yeah love is in reverse it's like they wanted you to put up with like player behavior they like how it makes you upset with them argue with them it's best to like like this is going to be nothing but drama if you stick around if they don't heal as well clarify spiritual cleanse please yeah some of you need to like cleanse from this person protect your energy tower in reverse again it's like either you continue with them and it just stays the same way or you walk away clear your energy protect your energy and find someone more stable unless this person decides to heal but this is what I'm seeing. It, it's given one story. And it's... They like drama, basically. They like it. And they're obsessed with you. So they could be a Libra. Leo, Sagittarius. Libra, again. Scorpio. I think those are the main signs. Yeah. And Capricorn. So... I hope this was helpful. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.